All right, what's going on, people? We're back. We got old Brewie with us. Yeah, he's back. So, pretty much, we're gonna be releasing these pheasants. We'll show you these, these guys later. Uh, we're doing that tomorrow, but today we gotta do some prep work. So, we are at my boss's place. Here you go. If you wanna take that. And we got a kitty pool set up over there, but pretty much we gotta trim some of this grass around this tree. We're gonna set up a trail camera to see if the pheasants are coming in and getting this. And, uh, then yeah, we'll fill up the pool, and then tomorrow you'll see us get these pheasants unloaded, so stay tuned. Alright, bro's gonna go ahead and turn around this tree. This is his toy. Alright, while he's working on that, I'll show you this pool. Keep going. So, here's the kitty pool. We got a rock in there to weigh it down. Some sticks in case they accidentally fly in there or something. And, uh, yeah, so we're pretty much gonna turn the well on and fill that back up. There is a creek down here. You guys have seen me pheasant hunt here before. Uh, there is a creek down here, and luckily it's holding water. We're in a massive drought this year, so everything really dry. But uh, it's best to see. Terrible job. <laughs> so he just finished that up, and I'm coming to get the trail cameras. It's in the old Dixie cut. That's what we call this. All right. Ow. We got a little saw, strap, trail camera thing. Ow. That's why you don't get tall. Hey, if you are a kid, so don't grow up to be tall. You hit your head on stuff. Get her? Yep. Right. All right. So, I'm gonna put the camera down. I'll let Brody film me putting this up. And uh, we'll get this working and pull filled up. And then uh, skip to releasing these crazy wild birds. If you guys want to see a little bit of stuff that I've done, I think I posted a picture of when they were real little. Uh, I'll put my Instagram link down in the bio, or in the description. I mean, you did a good job on this. It's perfect. All right, you recording? Yeah. Perfect. All right, we're gonna go ahead and trim these little pieces right here. That way. That. That piece is fine. Ow! Thank you. See guys, this is why you gotta have a good friend like old Brody. You can't have any of these fake friends. Alright. Something like that should be good. Tight. Throw on a tester here. All right, what do you think, Brody? What? What do you think? I don't think. Oh. Well, we're gonna go ahead, go in the shop, turn the well on. My dad was nice enough to fix the well for me. It's down there. All right, people will come over here to the breaker. Flip that on. All right, Brody said he'd string out the hose. I promise, I'm not putting them to the labor ports here. Let's go ahead and pull it like that. Oh, just like this? Yeah. Alright, let's go ahead and turn the water on. Oh, it spreads. Probably got stuff all over my face. I'm sorry. She working? Yep. Mm 
Well, I'd say it doesn't get more redneck than this, but I know somewhere in the south it does, so. Yeah, pretty much we just got a rock in there. We dumped it out because we got a bunch of grass clippings in there. Hey, we got the grass clippings trimmed up, so it matters. We got the camera set up. Really, if that don't take any pictures, it's not a big deal. Let's go ahead and show you where we're going to release these. So, we come down off of this hill. We're going to be loading all the pheasants up in the back of my truck. We got a net that's going to go over the top. Pretty much we're going to come down this hill, me and Brody here. We're going to drive down this road. We'll probably back up right about here, something like that. Then we're going to drop the tailgate down. They're going to fly out here. You guys have seen me hunt this before. There should still be water here. Hopefully. See how close Brody can be so water without falling in. <laughs> you see it? I see water. Does it look deep? Uh, want me to jump in and find out? No, because you're getting in my truck. Uh, maybe not that much. Oh, they're good. Good job, Brady. Uh, so yeah, let's let this water fill up and uh, then we'll get to releasing these birds. Alright, well, birds here, so there's all the pheasants. There they are. What are you thinking, bro? They've grown since the last time I saw them. Yeah, they got a little bigger. We do have a bit of a pecking problem. We have one die, but we seem fine. Let's get it. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and put the camera away. And work. All right, well, Brody and I are back here. We're testing out this tarp thingy for the pheasants. It's pretty nice. There ain't no wind. There, that looks a little better. Yeah, there ain't no wind back here. What do you think, Brody? No wind, just a little breeze. Just a little breeze. You heard it here. All right, sorry about the drone noise, but we got the pheasants loaded up. Brody and I did pretty good with that, with help of the barn owners. We're gonna go ahead and let Brody do the honors here. All right, Brody, have at her. Let's go ahead. And Did you just hear that one? No. And <laughs> one just cocked down there. Ready? Yep. Now let's see if I can figure out how to open up the box. that box out and, or pick up a few and throw them off the edge. That's why. Pick them up and throw them, Brody. Pick them up and throw them. Let them fly all the way down there. We'll be good for them. Let's toss them up. Oh, well, that one's going to land on the tracks. Nope. Oh, you swerved it. Pick up another one. Wrong way, buddy. Just don't fall off 
the edge, dude. It's like a 15 foot drop. Come here. Come here. Let's get these ones off real quick. Oh, we're good, we're good. Come on, bird. Fly. Before the train comes, go. Oh, no way. We beat the train. Yeah. I didn't think we would. Oh, did you see him hit the fence? No. He was, he was so close. I think he clipped the barbed wire. All right, folks, we're gonna go ahead and clean up the barn. You guys don't wanna see that, it's gonna be boring. Then we're gonna drop off some food, stuff, and we'll be good to go, so we'll see you then. All right, well, we got all the food back up. There was a lot of food here, we had some food. It's all been cleaned up, so. Brody thinks it's fun, man. He does this like a real man should. So, I'll be a weenie and carry the half bag. Stuff it over here, bro. There's a bear right there. Oh, geez. Looks like he got attacked by that hawk. His foot's broken or something. Ugh. All right, guys. Well, Pheasants 2021 is officially over. Food's all dumped out. Unfortunately, when we, when Brody and I pulled up, there was a hawk sitting down in the grass, and it didn't really want to move until I ran out, scared it up. And uh, while we were spreading the grain, we did find a pheasant that was still alive, but it had a broken wing. So more than likely, he is taken out, and that's just the way the circle of life is. Stuff's gonna get eaten now. They have real predators, so. It's just the way it works, but we got to do it in the first place, and it was great. We had a 58% per uh, survival rate, which for pheasants sounds terrible, but it was actually really good. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, sorry I didn't get to do more of a kind of a series, but other than feeding and watering, there isn't really that much to do with these birds. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Also, make sure you subscribe to my channel if you guys are not, and leave some comments down in the comment section below. Until next time, Eric Mooney, out.